Good evening everybody and once again welcome to the video. This video I'll be talking about one of the most interesting topic in the Elasticsearch. Uh, in the new version of Elasticsearch 8 they have recently announced, announced uh, Elasticsearch fleet and agents. And according to me this is really a game changer uh, in Elasticsearch. Uh, why I say that? Um, I'll, I'll show you some of the slides and remember this is really very new right now I am also experimenting and learning of watching a lot of videos so I just want to give you a glimpse and introduction about uh, this topic all right so I have some definition and then hopefully I be I, I should be able to show you a very small demo uh, elastic agent is a single unified way to add monitoring for logs matrix and other types of data to the host it can also protect the host from security threats, query the data from operating system and more. A single agent makes it easier and faster to deploy monitoring across your infrastructure. Each agent has a single policy you can update to add integrations uh, for new data sources, security uh, protection and more. So I have some slides. Of course, it will be it will definitely interest you. So this is what integration looks like. They have added a whole new feature of integration. So you name it and you have it, right? For example, uh, let's read this and then uh, understand a little bit about integration. Integration provides an easy way to connect to the Elastic external services and system and quickly get insights or take action. They can collect data, they can collect new sources of data and they often ship with out of the box assets like dashboard, visualization and pipelines to extract, to extract structured field out of logs and event. This makes it easier to get insights within seconds. Integrations are available for popular services like or platforms like Nginx, AWS and many, many more. To give you a glimpse, take a look at this. This is insane these features in elastic 8 is absolutely insane so you can come here aws assure cloud literally rabbitmq matrix dynamo db you just name it and you have it right it makes it extremely easy to you know essentially collect a logs and data right for example let's search for kafka you have kafka right just name it and you have it right so makes it absolutely easy to essentially just choose Within few seconds, bang, you're done. These are the uh, images are taken from the following video. Okay, so the, here I have provided which video. So in in, in previous, uh, we used to essentially, <laughs> on every host, we used to install file beats, matrix beats, heartbeat, endpoint, winlog beat, APM, etc, etc, yara, yara, yara. But with this elastic agent, on every host, you have only one elastic agent for logs, matrix, security, uptime, traces, and Windows data. One thing to install, configure, and manage, scale, and secure. So this is essentially what agents are, uh, um, they do, right? I mean, previously this was so tedious. Managing all these files, configuration, now they make it so, so, so easy. Another uh, screenshot that I've taken from this is about, again, integration. One click uh, adds out-of-the-box parsing and dashboard deploys to agent. I'll show you a demo where it comes with out of the box dashboard. That's simply amazing. Um, so 100 plus integration, uh, you know, CLI not needed, uh, you know, and, um, so that's essentially integration. Before you had to do this, right? YML file, configure things, but now it's simply toggling buttons and clicking buttons and there you go within seconds. Uh, you can also, they have a security feature. You can protect your host uh, from security threats. While you observe, why not protect? So automated response to security threats on hosts like malware, deploy Elastic Agent with one click. So there is a really, really lot, lot more uh, to this, right? You can centrally manage Elastic Agents. You can have hundreds, thousands of agents, right? You can see, monitor the status, are they healthy, unhealthy example. Quick visibility to status of your agents in the fleet. Manage your agents across many thousands of hosts. Uh, just one click update the policy across all the agents. Improve security with per agent API keys. Uh, no more headaches with PowerShell, Chef, uh, Ansible, etc. <laughs> so that is essentially in a nutshell about uh, this. And which is why I say use the word game changer, right? Now, 
uh, it again I had to watch a lot of you know videos blogs spend countless hours to figure things out right so uh, first of all uh, as you can see uh, you know I have an agent uh, sorry I have a fleet here uh, with the name JTD Shah I have configured this on my machine right so I was able to do that oops that's the Kipana console this one so essentially I did um, you know uh, installed my agent here you can see Elastix agent has been installed successfully and then I, I, I see the status as healthy and when was uh, the last activity was 32 seconds ago now an amazing thing that, that they offer is now I can go to integrations and out of the box you can add any integration as you want right I have installed uh, a predefined one for example elastic agent that essentially t tells you you know now for example as you can see right you don't need to build dashboards right what I'm explaining you is come see, see take a look at this so if you come to assets they have visualization and overview dashboards I click here automatically it will load a pre-built dashboard you don't have to build a dashboard so this makes visualization of your logs and stuff in a matter of seconds right so now hopefully this this would open up might take a second or two I think I did open up for you yeah I already have it opened up since it takes a while so yeah here you can see I can you know filter by host and I can see all my matrix here that's simply uh, you know mind-blowing right you uh, if you want to see a particular visualize for example let's I want to dive into memory and CPU usage right I just click on that and predefined dashboard is loaded right uh, might take a second or two It takes a, it, it takes a little while because my you know everything is installed on my computer locally at this point so hopefully once it does load up uh, and I know it does take a while but now here I can you know essentially visualize my you know CPU matrix uh, you know all that stuff I can easily visualize here it comes out of the box I did not install anything okay uh, they have you know pre-built dashboards for all these stuff for example now let me show you this I have been trying to work with this I haven't uh, again I'll make more tutorials in depth about all these stuff so for example let's say you wanna grab uh, matrix for docker right look at this this is simply phenomenal because now I can go to docker matrix I can add and then uh, if I just show you the screenshot here it takes a little while uh, my computer it, it's uh, you know so here you can see container how many containers are running how many containers are stopped their memory the CPU the network everything out of the box right all you gotta do is add the uh, just uh, add the integration right um, so that's that and not only that look at this this is mind-blowing it comes with the built-in dashboards right so you click here of course I haven't enabled that but you click here and they have a full-blown dashboard for you so this makes things very very easy right uh, of course I haven't done it then visualization if you want to go into a particular stuff docker container matrix uh, you just click on it and it would load right so uh, you know all these stuff out of the box right which is why um, I, I specifically use the word it's a game changer right uh, definitely you want to try this out and learn uh, however I do want to say I, I, I spent a couple I spent literally more than two days on this right uh, make sure uh, you are working with elastic 8.2 Kibana version 8.2 uh, yeah because the older version you might have issues right so make sure you're using that uh, that's it for this video thank you so much for watching I hope this was a very nice overview and I'll try my best to make an uh, in-depth videos and guides about all these amazing uh, out-of-the-box integration that um, essentially Elastic offer, right? Thank you so much for watching. Keep smiling and I'll see you guys in the next video. By the way, all the resources and uh, all the resources are linked in the description. So if you want and want to read more, go to the actual source and read, okay? Thank you so much. I'll see you in the next video.